What's up? What's up, everybody? Better like playing the Guardian. I would tell you what game I'm playing, but if you can't guess that, because <laughs> I don't play anything else, I need to change that, and I will change that. I want to add more, uh, I want to diversify my gaming, let's put it that way. Okay, there's one coming to grass. Oh, he went back. Um. Gun battery firing. Advantage to you, Blazer Squad. Oh, I totally lost my train of thought. I know I was talking about diversifying my gaming. Oh, I did try. That's what I said. I ain't gonna lie. This pass. Hmm. I don't think it was this weekend. It was the weekend before. Oh, Blizzard sent me a little tempting email. They said, hey, come back and see this new Siege of Ogremar expansion or raid or whatever it is. I think it's a patch, 5.1, 5.4, and, uh, you know, seven days free. So, of course, I didn't even have WoW installed on my game, on my computer. And I uh, had to download it, install it, go through all that motion. And then um, got in, started playing my Warlock, had no idea how to play him. I was in the uh, daily area, kind of, if you're familiar with WoW. I was in the where you did the dailies when Mr. Pandorf, Pandaria first started. And there was nobody there. <laughs> I remember that place, that area was hopping. It was where the Klaxis are. Because so I guess I was working on that faction. Nobody there. So I know there's some new quest hub and, and, and other better things to do. So, um... I still stuck around there, played a little bit. Played maybe 30, 45 minutes. And lost interest. I, I never PvP'd in WoW that much. I mean, my total lifetime kills is like 25,000. So, like, to give you an idea, there was a time where when I first started playing WoW, it was for PvE content. I had to take a break. I came back and just did PvP. Did that for a little while, and then when I came back in, did that for a little while, quit again, stopped playing again. Went back. And went back PvE, and I mainly played WoW as a PvE uh, player. I, I didn't care for the PvP too much in WoW. So, anyway, long story short, I'm not playing that game right now. And here comes some action. For the love. It's about time. Right? Oh, he disappeared. He disappeared. Hey! What? Why? You're taking fire. Oh no! That's not good. How did we lose? Oh, they came and stomped us on snow, huh? Go back. Get out of here. I don't know. I'm just the, uh, the low level watching grass, man. I'm talking to my friends. This is the spec, just in case you want to see it. I have had some questions about my armor. I generally have all customized armor, and as you can see, I tend to keep my mods. They're all blue, most of them, except for my strength, uh, I mean from my hilt, hilts and barrels I do purple, but you know, the only reason why I do that is because I find that arms tech and artifice, I got, I get tons of purple mats and I don't make anything purple, I mean yeah I can make the, uh, some of the arm ring mods or enhancements purple, but I feel like it's kind of a waste, I don't make, get that many purple mats, but so, and since, you know, leveling 
is I mean since I'm low level and I'll be leveling constantly, I don't really find that it's worth keeping all my armorings purple. So yeah, I won't worry about purples too much until I reach max level, but at the rate I'm going, it's gonna be a long time from now. <laughs> I would not be surprised if you could get to 60 by the time I get close to 55. Because, uh, doing all eight characters at once, not counting that I'm doing four Empire characters, not counting that I've opened up four slots to get another four Empire characters to where I can have all eight Republic and all eight Empire. I hadn't even started making those other four Empire characters, so. There's a lot of stores in my future. All right, we got the turret is yours. Firing on striker squads. The grass is clear still. Well, we got people stuck trying to get mid. Oh, I'm gonna say one. Come on now. Oh. Oh. I don't know how I just did that. I ain't gonna lie, I tore that dude up. Wow. I don't know, did that guy have like level 20 armor on or something? He's 51. It's like everything critted just time. That was just, some, oh my god, we three captain. <laughs> Enemy vessel taking fire. I kind of knew this match was going to go pretty good. Only because I seen, oh wow, that didn't last too long. <laughs> we didn't hold middle that long. On your ship, Blazer Squad. Only because I've seen some of the people that was in this this war zone before it started and I had an idea that it was going to be a good one. But, uh, again, welcome to Watching the Node at Grass, brought to you by Fedalot. And all I need now is a monster, some energy drink to really get me all hyped up and going and you really think I'm crazy. Man, he's still trying to get in middle again. Alright, I'm gonna say, went to grass again. This time it's a 47 shades that's gonna eat my lunch. Yes, I got a vanguard to come help me out there. Yes. It's all bubbled up. Why are you all bubbled up? Ah, me and my over there, mom, mom. Come on now. Oh, why you stunned me, man? Negative 152. What the heck was that? Alright, let's say grass clear. Put everybody at ease. Now, what is this? Damage taken from the construct. Come on, one guy. Uh, hey! Don't do that! Blazer Squad, your ship has sustained heavy. Well, damage. it's almost to the point to where they can't come back. That's the one thing I hate about this war zone. This war zone is a fun one. This is one of my favorites. And the only thing I don't like about it is there's once you get a certain once you double their score, uh, only way for them to come back is to get all three. And obviously, if they have a hard time to get two, you know, <laughs> I'm gonna get three. So I, it's not impossible to come from behind. I, I almost want to say I've never, it's never happened to me. 
If it has, it's been one or two occasions. It's really, really rare for a team that's behind. There was one. No. I did partake in the. Uh, Enemy shields are failing. In a war Maintain zone not assault. too long ago. I think it was past weekend that I wish I would have uh, recorded. I did, and I was playing on the Empire side. And we won the Civil War 10 to 0. <laughs> but we didn't come from behind. Uh, I mean, the score never doubled. It came, it almost did, obviously. But once we took the second one, we hung on to both turrets and it was game over. So, yeah. But anyway, oh, we got some more action. I'm not even gonna bother calling it. I don't think anybody else is coming. That's how she's on, just so this guy here is not, uh... forgot about this. Ooh. What was that? Oh, here comes some more flying. Oh, he's on healer. Away so I can finish this guy. Nope, we're not. We gotta. I'll keep him busy now. Come on, everybody. Well done, Blazer Squad. You've successfully routed the enemy ship. Simulation complete. You know what? I totally forgot. Yes, I do have Cyber Throw. Totally forgot about it. Cyber Throw. Cyber Throw. <laughs> cyber. What is a Cyber? Let's see. Uh, I did no damage. I protected a little bit. Who healed? Hmm. I didn't have too many healing. Anyway, thanks for watching. Wow, you made it to the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Click on any one of these video links to check out more. If you would like to help me stay out of fire traps, prevent me from being forced pushed off of bridges, and to make me feel like a ninja, be a subscriber today. Take care.